Courtney, thank you. This is also new tonight. Family and friends of Brittany Stikes gathering to celebrate what would have been her 32nd birthday. She was found shot to death in Brown County in 2013 and no one has ever been charged for her murder. Hey, Marsha was there. She spoke with her family as well and she's live with more. Yeah, Rob, Trisha, family gathered here today, and you can even see there's orange flowers, there's kind words, there's a cross here, all in memory of Brittany Stikes. The family says it's important to celebrate her birthday, to keep her memory alive as they continue to seek justice. It, it doesn't ever get easier. That emptiness is still there. Emotions unfolded as balloons flew high on Thursday to celebrate what would have been Brittany Stikes' 32nd birthday. Happy birthday, Brittany. Stikes was only 22 years old when she was shot and killed inside her yellow Jeep. And so was the life growing inside of her. Stikes' little girl, Aubrey, was in the back seat at the time of her death. Aubrey was shot in the head but survived. It's a day Mary and David called a nightmare. And it's hard to comprehend how someone can shoot a 14 month old child in their car seat and not have a conscience about it. Orange flowers are grounded in the memory of Aubrey's mother. Aubrey is now 10 years old, and her grandparents say she deserves to have answers. And I told her her mommy was in heaven, and I took her out and showed her the stars. Like her mother, her mother used to sit outside and show her the stars. And I, I took her out there and I said, mommy's up there. And I walked back in with her and I told her I was gonna rock her to sleep. And she looked at me and she says, Mammy, 14 months old, I don't wanna be here. I wanna be in heaven with mommy. That was the hardest time other than losing my daughter that I've had in my life. It's been nearly 10 years since Brittany's murder and the case has gained national attention. The family says they'll keep speaking and showing up until they receive justice. That, that killer shot my daughter. Uh, I lost a grandchild and shot my other granddaughter. So that's a killer out there that could possibly do it again. No one has been charged for the murder of Brittany Stikes, but police have questioned several suspects. And Fox 19's Jessica Schmidt, Schmidt actually really goes into detail on the progression of this case. You can actually watch those details on Fox 19 Cincinnati's Crime Vaults. You can find that on our website. Reporting live in Brown County, Peyton Marshall, Fox 19 Now. Peyton, thank you. Take you outside right now. It's a